history is being made today in the Metro Public School System. The school board has chosen its first African American as director following a nationwide search. As News Channel 5 Steve Hazlip finds, leaders say it sends a strong message to students. I have called uh, to let you know that not only has this board unanimously selected you as our next director of schools, but we have unanimously agreed to the terms within the contract. And all I need to hear from you is... I accept. All right. The words this board wanted to hear brought tears of joy. After a long, exhaustive search, Metro Schools named their next director, Dr. Sean Joseph of Prince George's County, Maryland. It's history for Nashville, the first African American to lead this large school system for our city. Board members say that's a lesson for students they just can't get in the classroom. The majority of the 86,000 students that attend Metro schools like Waverly Belmont are African American. Board members are thrilled that those students now have a role model that looks just like them. I am pleased. The I former teacher turned school. principal wowed board members with his push for community-wide teamwork to better Metro schools. You know, he spoke a lot about wraparound services and, and needing the nonprofit community, the faith community community, the government, you know, local and both and, and federal um, to, to buy into what it is we're trying to accomplish and to do the things that are necessary that we haven't done in the past. Dr. Joseph takes over at a time when teachers are under fire, rattled by common core state standards and increased pressure. Being one of them, they say will go a long way. I think he's someone that's going to listen to teachers. I think he's going to be very collaborative. And I think it's important right now that at a time when teachers don't feel heard and don't feel part of the discussion. I think the teachers will embrace him. I think the administrators will embrace him because he's truly is an instructional leader. He seemed excited on the phone, ready to get started. And that's exactly how board members in the room were feeling as well. Steve Hayslip, News Channel 5. Now, Dr. Joseph's salary will be $285,000 a year, which is about $20,000 a year more than the former director was earning. He'll begin in July. Shortly after Dr. Joseph accepted the position, Mayor Megan Barry shared her thoughts on the decision, saying in part, I want to applaud the school board on their decision and for a process that was open and inclusive to the entire community and thank all of the terrific candidates who have participated in this process. I look forward to working with Dr. Joseph over the coming years to ensure that he has the resources and support he needs to ensure successful outcomes for all of our students.